Hello YouTube, welcome back to Thrust Victor Gaming and another episode of Planet Base. First, I want to tell you that uh, if you notice any difference in uh, how I sound, that's because I bought myself a new headset. After last week's episode, my headset went on and, uh, well, take suicide on itself. So now I'm on a new headset here, it's a HyperX Cloud 2, like it really much actually. So yeah, that's uh, the reason why my voice might sound a little bit different and this is how um, it will sound for you guys uh, for the rest, hopefully, of this, this series here. I don't think I need to uh, buy myself a new headset in, in the near future now. So we're gonna look at today's goal here. Uh, last week we uh, got some more guards here. We built, uh, I think we built a new... Um, security console here one of many things we did we also added an armory and uh, today I'm gonna focus on uh, I, I've been to talking about getting a bar for uh, for quite some time now and uh, I think I'm gonna build that bar um, we do need metal it's a resource that we have very little of but I think we're gonna manage uh, right now all of our metal is, uh, well, almost all of our metal is being eaten up by s the semiconductor foundry and the arms workshop, for example. So, um, uh, yeah, but I, I think we're going to build a bar anyway. Uh, in the meantime, I should say, I should probably go over here and look. Let's see. I do want to buy this metal here and see if we can get all the metal. It's 180. Um, in a value and uh, well I think we're, we're gonna go with bioplastic and see if we can exchange uh, enough I'm gonna leave myself with like maybe two bioplastic we're gonna take two medicine actually we're gonna go with maybe three so I have one one left here that's 175 it's something to weigh that up could probably go with a spare but then well I don't know maybe uh, I think we're gonna go with the spare there and uh, save some uh, save some bioplastic here it's 180 180 that's good gonna do the trade now we should get some more metal going here uh, when we're gonna build the bar we need vegetables that's what's get turned into alcohol. So I'm gonna add some more pads to the biodome here. And we want a lot of vegetables. I'm gonna go with something that grows very fast. I think that is tomato, isn't it? Well, lettuce or tomato. Um, we're gonna go with the tomato pad. Uh, two tomato pads. I guess we're gonna be able to. Yeah think our biologists can cope with the um, two fast producing pads here. Tomato is, is much better than lettuce in uh, in a bar. You make Bloody Marys. Can't make Bloody Marys with uh, lettuce. So yeah. <laughs> uh, let's see here. The bar then. Oh, right. I need to uh, make this connection here again because in the end of last episode I noticed that for some reason one of my carrier bots had gone uh, building himself in or someone, someone else had built him into this uh, little maze here not even a maze you can't you can't get in or out so I had to destroy the connection here so we're gonna build up the, uh, a new connection there uh, the bar is well I've, I've told you that I wanted to have the bar for a long time, but uh, it might not be the most important thing right now, uh, since uh, if we take a look at a random person like him here, very satisfied, he has high moral. Um, so yeah, I don't need a bar for that matter, but uh, I think we'll add to the uh, the old base. I mean, we we've we've grown into a. a point where I think you you could actually add a bar we have 
sort of a hospital, we have guarding, we have storage, we can make our own food, we have food production, metal production, we produce a lot of stuff, so why not get a bar at this stage? I'm gonna see how far we've come with the trading here. So that one is pending that resource. It's coming there. Beat it up a little bit here. Like so, and now we have 12 metal. That's good. We are gonna build the bar here. Let's see, bar. And I'm thinking of where I should put this. I mean, can't put it over here. Uh, cannot place it anywhere over there. So it's somewhere here, but the question is, should it be like there or should we place it more over in this direction here? I'm not sure. I mean, we need vegetables. The vegetables are either at the storage or they are in the um, the uh, oh, what's the main compl name completely here the biodome so I'm not sure if it's better I mean even if I put it I don't think I can put it over here Let's see because that's kind of close to the um, storage tilted there uh, well I can actually put it there so Let's see I think I'm actually no no I'm gonna put it down here and I'm gonna go with a I'm gonna go with a small one but leave room so that I can actually uh, make it larger in the future so uh, place a large one like that and then make it smaller now I know I have a room because I've placed it here might not be able to build a larger one in the future so I'm gonna place it there make a small one and make the connection another thing that I want to build but I don't think we have the metal for it um, we're gonna see and uh, later on, hopefully, we we know have a decision in uh, maybe in the end of this uh, this episode. I want to build a starport, I believe. It's if I would say I have uh, a good amount of um, food production going, because if we can get visitors here. That would be great it could boost our economy we could get um, coins for actually having visitors here and for that coin i could uh, buy well resources that i that i need and uh, hopefully the base will expand uh, in a more rapid way so while they're building the bar here i'm gonna go and have a look on the milestones here because I mean this is kind of the end goal of this whole game when you ticked all this well you've done it more or less I mean you can expand your base beyond uh, say population of 300 uh, if you built everything here you you got 10 bots more than 10 bots uh, it's an endless game almost well the the map has some borders. I mean, if we go out this way here, I think it's somewhere over here. Yeah, here's kind of the end of the map. I can't go further in that direction. No. But uh, we we still have a lot of area here to uh, to populate. So, uh, as I said, milestones. Uh, I'm gonna look what the next big thing would be here uh, population 100 we're at 23 right now so probably not in the near future uh, i don't know but we'll see uh, 500 kilowatts of power i see here oh can't click uh close that one we are generating 
139, 140. I saw it was up on 141, so I, I don't know exactly how much we can produce, but uh, well, actually we could look at this one. 50 plus 50 is 100, 30, 30. So 160 is our uh, generation or how much we can generate, I would say. So, well, maybe 500 uh, kilowatts is it's a decent target as well. Uh, 10 techs, probably not. Uh, 100 in prestige, I don't know I, where I can find my prestige. I believe I can see it in the charts here, but uh, we're going to leave that one. Uh, I would say probably 10 bots is the, is the next goal to aim for. And I, I really need bots. They work faster in mines, they're carrying stuff much faster and well, everything's better with bots, really. When you see here, take a look what this trading ship has to offer. Metal and ores. You're going to see on the ore side here, we don't have... Well, we do have one ore. How are we doing over at the processing plant? This one... Uh, I believe there's a ore in there. Consumes ore. No, it's not. It's just one metal and no ores in here. Uh, we do have one ore over here. That's okay. Now it says two over here, so I I guess one ore is on the way over here. So perhaps I need. Yeah, I'm gonna go with actually taking both the metal and the ores here, and in return. We're gonna give them, I don't know, actually I can't really give them anything in return, so... I actually have to, no, we're not gonna do any trading here, for now. I'm gonna dismiss him. I'm gonna let him go. And... Why these are stacked here, I have no freaking idea. I mean, what just happened here? Uh, okay. Well, somebody probably will go and pick them up at some point, so uh, I don't think it's blocking the airlock. Hopefully it's not blocking the airlock. The bar is ready here, so we're gonna place some stuff in it. I want a bar table. I also want a drinking fountain. I think, yeah, we're gonna go with that. It's good to have uh, more than one. Currently, we have one over here. But uh, if you like are down here and want to take a drink, well, it's it, it, it's more it's better to go over here. And as we expand our base this way, uh, it will be a very long way for people to actually walk all the way over to the uh, canteen to actually. Have a drink and well i probably build another canteen over here anyway but um, good to um to have a drinking fountain here i mean one glass of alcohol and one glass of water right so uh, drinks machine so that we can produce the alcohol here the beverage I think and have some after work or something Friday afternoon good thing here that one got it's bioplastic this one needs one bioplastic as well are we totally out of bioplastic yeah I don't know uh, let's see here this one has starch in it no no one is working here you guys are probably gonna go work on this one now yep so let's see I don't think we have any bioplastic all bioplastic are being used probably in the uh, workshop 
arms workshop and the uh, semiconductor foundry so yeah actually gonna speed things up a bit here and hope that uh, eventually we get a better um, trading ship coming in uh, now we do have we're still kind of good on metal here have two ores I could get some more vegetables produced here that would be great and I can use that as kind of a currency and for trading it, it, it's not best currency I mean I think you get 10 or something out of a of, of one vegetable 10 coins but I mean it's something you could trade like two vegetables for or three vegetables for one or I believe so that's one I believe that's one is 15 uh, by plastic oil is also 15 so uh, that would be a great deal to to take like yeah, a couple of vegetables three vegetables for one by plastic that's good good trade-off okay the drinks machine is working here. We are producing some beverage. Alcoholic drink there, yeah. Uh, so this one's using power. It's using water. So we're gonna just take a quick look of uh, how we're doing on that front here. Uh, we are producing... Let's see, I'm gonna slow the game down a bit here. Using 78, producing 130. So we're good on that front. Water production is... Well, we're doing pretty good here. I believe we could hopefully check that... Uh, soon. That water production actually goes up during night. So hopefully we're gonna reach something like... 10 or something? I think it was that way. Or perhaps the other way that... It goes down in the night, but I don't think so. I think it actually goes up at night. Yeah, let's see here. Trading. We have a lot of ore and starch. I like that. So we're gonna go with trading away some vegetables here. Yeah, actually, five out of it. Not a good trade. Uh, Ten for ores, five for starch. And yeah, we, we, we have a good amount of metal for the moment. So I'm actually going to go with a starch here. Something like that, perhaps. Yeah. And that's not enough, so... Do like that, then. Three coins and six vegetables. That leaves me with... Or vegetables left and and well that's good so make the trade and speed things up again sandstorms coming I'm not sure of what we should do here uh, I think we're actually gonna let people work yeah no uh, yeah it's it's not a long way they have to walk out there I mean they are gonna take some uh, see health is going down but um, I don't think they really need medical care hopefully not anyway because we have very low supply medical supply here okay they actually need perhaps medical attention anyway Speaking of which, I do have, I believe, two medics, or even three. I'm gonna take a look on that one. Yeah, I have I have three medics and one bed. I, I need more beds. I mean, I probably don't need three beds be just because I have three medics. But, well, because they they working in... Not everyone is working at the same time. 
sometimes they are at sleep. I mean, probably some of these guys over here are actually medics, so... But I'm gonna build a bed anyway here. Uh, two beds, three medics. Uh, better than one bed anyway. I mean, it's, it's gonna take on my um, bioplastic supply uh, here, but uh, it's worth it. So I got the starch here, and that's good. We can produce um, bioplastic. Which we also are doing here. Very, very soon we're gonna have the bioplastic we need for the bed here. And after that, uh, I guess the rest of the bioplastic will uh, get over here to the uh, semiconductor foundry and, uh, well, all these uh, foundries and, uh, and workshops here. And I actually missed what it says down here, or said down here. I have no idea how to really find that again. Hope oh, wasn't bad, like no one has died or anything, but... The shards are always helpful. Nope, no one has died anyway. So I am unsure what it said. We're doing pretty good on vegetables, that's always a good thing. These ones are in excellent condition, good condition, it's good. This one is decent, but I mean, we have a biologist working on it. That one is in excellent condition. These ones though are in poor condition, I don't like that. No. I know you can do prioritize work in this structure and I'm gonna try it and see what happens um, hopefully these won't uh, get will be suffering from that but um, if they are I might have to go back here and uh, switch that one off So, yeah, I, I don't know what we should really do here right now. Uh, we're pretty much at a standstill. We are low on bioplastic for the moment. We do have a lot of metal, though. Uh, our colonists in general, well, they are happy, healthy, everything's good. Uh, so I I think I'm actually gonna, gonna take a break here. And uh, next episode... Uh, or after this episode, I will do some, uh, some off-screen playing here. I will get our bioplastic uh, up a bit. Uh, I won't add any more structures or anything. I will just uh, kind of time accelerate until I get uh, enough bioplastic and everything like that. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, if you like what you've uh, seen, don't forget to um, hit that um, like button, of course. Uh, if you're interested in more of this content, uh, give some love to the subscribe button as well and uh, yeah until next time uh, i wish you the very best that's all for this week folks this is thrust vector gaming signing out